pretty common reoccurring trope is I kind of look touristy. Everyone's in like a suit or at least dressed like somewhat nice and here I am and in a t-shirt and shorts. Weather is actually quite nice compared to Will Scott Jamboree. Yes, it's like 70 degrees. It's supposed to get hotter later, but it's like medium humidity, which I am a big fan of. So I have like 40 minutes to kind of just goof around and do whatever I want. I'm gonna go to a GS25 just to see what's inside. You know, yesterday we went to the uh, Nice to See You. We're gonna just go to a GS25, see what's up. See if everything is like as expected, I guess. I have purple Red Bull. Peach drink was all right. I don't know why I thought it would be different. Everything is exactly the same. Um, we're on time. All right, we're gonna eat lunch before we go to LOL Park. Um, we're getting fried chicken. We're at the fried chicken place. We're at the fried chicken place. All right, Victoria, show us what you got. Got this and and. Oh yeah. There was nothing at Lowell Park that we could get for anyone. There was a PC cafe that I might try to play at later. We'll see, we'll see. Because I know tomorrow it's going to be raining pretty hard, so I might just spend a lot of time at that PC cafe. Like everything here is just different types of fabric. It's pretty interesting. Never seen anything like it in the States, at least. So we escaped the fabric store. Um, we're trying to find an Olive Young right now. And if you remember anything about Olive Young, is that we found an Olive Young near the KT station or the KT Park, KT Wizards Park. And we went there because we ditched the baseball game or at least the first half of it. Coffee bean and tea leaf, Chicago cheesecake, Americano, and then Victoria got some kind of tea, apricot tea. Apricot tea. Yeah, apricot Cylon tea. So, turns out the night market that we're going to right now, actually, I've already been there. Um, if you remember the World Scout Jamboree vlog, Cassidy does a little bit of the vlog collab where she films the inside of an almond store and that it's like in that same general area. It's the service desk, the guy who was sitting at the service desk at our hotel explained how the end, the end like destination, there you should see the almond store, right? And when I saw the almond store, I instantly thought of that moment and I knew, oh, we've been there before because of that moment. That's so crazy. But yeah, we're going, it's just like old times, just like old times. This Olive Young has two floors. Victoria's gonna look at some socks, but I think after that we head back to the hotel. And I think that's it for the night. Extremely cool day today. Not very hot at all. I'm very happy about that. Guys, they closed down the Adidas for Al's make. <laughs> Just kidding. 
So the top, the, on the top of the hill, there's Tokyo Tower, or not Tokyo Tower, Seoul Tower. Do you want to go? Sure, I'd be down. She just made a big mistake. All right, guys. So all I can remember every time that I think about the Tokyo Tower, Tokyo Tower, Seoul Tower, is the fact that we took a hike to the Seoul Tower in 90 degree weather, like 70% humidity. It was practically raining. That's how much humidity there was in the air. It was 90 degrees, practically raining. And everyone was dressed in their full uniform, class A, neckerchief included. And we were like, please, Mr. Philbrook, can we please take off the, ooh, it's a Velocitor. That's crazy. <laughs> we were like, please, Mr. Philbrook, can we please take our, off our class A? It's 90 degrees. All of our like skin is like permanently sweaty. And we're running out of water. And he said, no, we can't take off our class A because every other troop is in our class A. Well, guess what? We were surrounded by Vietnamese troops. And if you know nothing about the, if you know anything at all about the Vietnamese scouts, is that their class A is pretty much a tank top. Anyways, <laughs> yeah, so rest in peace, Barry. Um, Barry was put out of commission uh, for the rest of the night because he caught a case of like heat uh, related illness and it was not that fun but what was fun was the view and the fact that the Seoul Tower was air conditioned that was pretty fun I like that <laughs> oh hell no hell to the no We did it. We got to Seoul Tower. Hey, we did it in like 10 minutes. No screen majors to hold us back. We contemplated turning back, but we prevailed. And we made it. Let's go. All right, I don't know if anyone knows the lore, but um, when I went to Jamboree last year, I bought this pair of earbuds, but I, they were so good and they were like 20 US dollars But I lost them on the plane flight back Right, so I had to complete the storyline and buy another pair and hopefully I don't lose these ones on the flight back Because they're legit good and I couldn't find them the entire trip until today. So Yeah, we got to keep these ones like under wraps 